No, shut your face. Listen to me. A couple days ago, you might have come across a video called Cooking with Cohen. <laughs> A ridiculous video where this man behind the camera put bacon on a vegan burger. Come on, man. Well, today, you're in for a treat. Welcome to Zooking with Zach. Dude, that's the, the exact same idea as Cooking with Cohen. You just no, it's, my name off. it's completely different. No, it's, it's you use the same idea like no, because it starts with the Z. Cooking, C and Cohen. Like, it just works like that because that's my name. You're changing the actual name Cooking to work with your name, which is. Doesn't need to happen. Let's zook. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna be making a delicious chicken pie today, everybody, and I can't wait to get started. Now, in Cohen's last video, he had a guiding book that he used called Salt, Fat, Acid, and Heat. Well, I have a book too that I'm gonna be using today, and it's called How to Cook Everything. So Dude, why are you holding my book? That is literally, I, I got that book from my mom. It's literally a birthday gift. But it's, I'm holding like, it. If you open up, if you literally open up the first page, it'll ha literally say like. It, it, it doesn't birthday. matter whose book is it because it's looking with Zach and I'm the one in charge. Okay. Good. Uh, you're the, you're the star, man. Okay, so first you're going to want to cook your chicken. I can't remember how. Dude, what are you doing? Shh. Are you, Shh. What, are you calling me? I'm phoning a friend. Are you phoning a friend? What are you doing phoning a friend? I need help. I, I didn't even use my phone a friend last time. Hi, mom. How's it going? Ah, uh, good. I'm just trying to make some food for me and Cohen. Um, but I, I have to cook the chicken first and I can't remember. I have a, I have a, I have a plate full of chicken breast tenders. Why don't you just look in the book at how to cook everything? Uh, just, so what would you, what would you do with this? And chicken? you don't remember what to do? No, what would, what would you do? What I would do is, if they're not too, if they're really thick, then I would cut them in half. I'd say they're about like a, a like a six? Put it in the pan with some butter and oil. Okay. How do I know if they're too thick or not? Well, like, I don't, like if they're more than an inch thick? I don't know. I, it's probably like... Probably like two thirds to three quarters of an inch. Or the easiest thing to do would actually just be cut it into little chunks of pieces and just cook it that way. You're so smart. I think I think I'm gonna do that. I'll just hack it to bits. Yeah, just cut it up into tiny little bite-sized chunks and cook it that way. Yeah, that's a good Okay, thank you, mom. You're welcome, bud. Wait, 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 what temperature? Yeah. Right, and I wait until it's, I wait until it's turned pink? No, you don't want it to be pink. Oh. Right, you need to have it when it's pink, then you can cook it with your hands. Right. Because then you can cook it with your hands. Yeah. Right. Then you can cook it with your hands. Right. Right. Then you can cook it with your hands. Right. Right. Then you can cook it with your hands. Right. One way ticket yeah. to Poopsville. Exactly. <laughs> I don't think we want that. Especially no. with the shortest of the paper. Maybe Cohen. Maybe coins can be a little pink. Dude, I'm right here. What? <laughs> I'm right okay, here. Okay, thank you, Mom. I'm gonna cook the chicken now. Okay, good luck, bud. Love you. Love you, too. Okay, bye. bye. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is take a pan, put it right there on your uh, your stove top. You can use, I use any um, of the four, you know, tops that I want. I don't really notice a difference. Um, I'm just going to put that on five there. You're also going to want to preheat your oven. So we're just going to toss that to 400 degrees. That's Fahrenheit, not Celsius. Don't make that mistake. Uh, I don't, and, think, uh, I don't think ovens can even go that high. You know, <laughs> and we're going to put some olive oil on there. Just a nice, I like to just drizzle it in a circular formation. Just going to keep chopping up some chicken to put on that pan. I just want to see your very delicate slices. Your little mouse hands doing the work. <laughs> I'm not a mouse. <laughs> I'm a boy. Now it's important that we cook the chicken all the way through because otherwise you'll get what the uh, natives call salmonella. I think that's a pretty common thing. Just like raw chicken. You are such a colonist. So we're gonna put our uh, chicken here in the pan. 
Just gonna scrape that off nice. Oh, love that sizzle, Sam. Yep. And uh, well, get in my pan! Now you're gonna take your fork and just, just play with it. Just tease it. You're just gonna wanna grab some salt. El sal in, in Spanish. Mm -hmm. uh, and just, yeah! Yes! Um, I don't know, what else do you want to put on there? Do you want to put some pepper? It, I, I guess so. The last thing I checked, it was looking with Zach, so. Uh, what else would you put on chicken? Oh, like, uh, put some... I have a can of celery seed. Oh, you can put some celery seed on there if you want. Look at that. So I'm just chopping the onion here. Um, you're going to want to, you know, get them onion bits nice and... And um, and cut, uh, and then you're gonna want to just keep doing that until you got no onion left. So we've taken the chicken out, we put it in a nice little bowl here to just, you know, let it steep and to let the, the aromas marinate, as it were. I think you're just saying cooking and, words uh, now. And uh, and we're gonna put the onions in now. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get in there. Get in there, you, you goofs. Goofy goobers. Don't you want to be cooked into delicious food? Hmm? Don't you want to be burned alive and stuffed in my mouth We're going to put in the garlic powder. Uh, I didn't chop up an actual garlic. Uh, so we're going to use this powder instead. I'm not sure how much to use. So let's just... Oh, God. <laughs> that just dumped out so <laughs> Just... Okay. Yeah, that's enough garlic powder right there, I think. So there you go, just one dump. <laughs> all right, so we're just finishing up chopping uh, all the stuff that's gonna go in next year. We got mushrooms, potatoes, and carrots. It's gonna be a very full pan. You're a very full pan. I actually, um, it didn't tell me how much. Uh, I didn't really look at how much to put in. So I just wanted to, you know, make a lot. Drop a couple carrots. Couple red carrots here, but uh, nothing goes to waste. Yeah, 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 yeah. There you go, there's your two cups. Two cups of broth. I, I really do think that we need some more celery seed. This is going to be my hidden ingredient to mm. this uh, masterpiece. That's a way to make it your own, you know what I mean? Yeah. I don't think I've ever tasted celery seed before. Mm. So it's really going to be a new thing for both of us. Yeah. Oh, yeah, baby. So once you got that mofo simmering, you're going to want to turn that down to like a low temperature. Uh, and it says to partially cover it. Leave it for about 12 minutes. We're gonna take a nice little bowl here and we gotta mix up some stuff. So first you're gonna to wanna to take your soup and just, just give it a spank. Mm. Now that we got our soup in there, we're gonna need a tablespoon and a half of flour. This is a one tablespoon scooper I've got here. So I'm just gonna mm. use that one there and then, you know, just Actually, probably a little bit more flour because, like I said, I got a lot of ingredients in there that uh, this recipe wasn't mm. prepared for. They want to compensate. Yeah. Uh, which is something that I do quite often. <laughs> oh, for what? I don't have a small penis. Well, our food has been boiling for quite a long time now, and it's uh, about time we put some other shit in there. <laughs> so I'm just going to take that lid off. And put it in the sink. And then we're gonna put our chicken in. Just, uh, ooh yeah, just, just right on top there. Now that it's marinated. And uh, we're gonna put in the mushroom soup. Uh, yeah, just gonna, the mushroom soup and the flour. Get in there. Add some parsley, right? Just gonna, just gonna shake some thyme. Some, some what, sorry? Hmm? Some, some thyme. Some, some thyme? Some thyme. Oh, right, thyme. Thyme leaves. Gotcha. 
God, Colin, you'd think you've never cooked anything before. Yeah, jeez. Like, yeah. like I know. Just shake that thyme in there. Can't have too much thyme, that's what I always say. Yeah, <laughs> sometimes I have too much thyme on my hands. You're right. What? I have too much like, thyme like on it, my hands. Like, as you spill it on yourself, like, you clumsy shit. <laughs> We're also gonna put in, that's the back of the bag. We're also gonna put in some bath salt. It almost sounds like you said bath salts. Don't put, don't put bath, don't, that's for after. Don't put bath salts in your chicken pie. Just so you know. Depends what kind of guy you are. You make your pie the way that you wanna make your pie. And I'll make my pie just like how I'm making it. Now is the time to take our delicious mixture off of the stove and put it in our casserole dish. So let's just bring this fellow on over. Don't want to drop that. Just, yeah, just right in there. And now, guys, it's time to make the crust. Rolling, rolling. Rolling the Pillsbury dough. Rolling Pillsbury dough. Rolling. 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 Rolling over my pie. Rolling Pillsbury dough. Pillsbury dough. Pillsbury dough. Pillsbury dough. Some people um like to cook with red wine. Uh, I like to drink wine while I cook. You're pretty lightweight, aren't you? You're just going for it. Oh my god. Am I lightweight, Colin? I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe I'm, you're proving me wrong right now. That's my drunk face. <laughs> <laughs> All right, bitches. <laughs> 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 Our dish is ready. Time to pull this bad boy out of the oven. Oh yeah, look at that. Doesn't that just make you just want to come Ooh. a little? That looks... <laughs> wow. It's still bubbling away. Chicken pie, ladies and gentlemen. Ooh. Ooh. Uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Now a couple things fell out there, so I'm just gonna add that to my plate. Just, yeah. A nice little top. Ooh. Ooh. What do you think? <gasps> Thank you so much for watching Zooking with Zach. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is how to cook everything. You're welcome. Thank you to my cameraman, Cohen Roy. Thank you to my mom for the help with the chicken and for the recipe. And thank you to you, even though you did nothing. Utterly useless. Yeah, I'll drink to that. That's, that's good. Because Cheers. you're utterly useless too? Yeah, exactly. I'll, yeah, for sure.